Can we stop a pandemic before it happens? Back in 1999, the zoonotic virus Nipah erupted in Malaysia and claimed the lives of 105 people and over a million pigs. In 2004, there had also been outbreaks of avian flu in Vietnam and Thailand, which spread rapidly throughout Asia and caused hundreds of fatalities. Many lives would be saved if we can stop a pandemic before it happens. 70% of epidemics in the world are caused by the spread of pathogens from animals to human. And Southeast Asia is one of the global hotbeds of emerging epidemics. The close relationship between humans and animals is one of the crucial enabling factors for outbreaks to occur. Chiang Mai, Thailand was chosen as a pilot study location because of its unique combination of habitats such as urbanized area, livestock farm, rural area, mountainous landscape, and indigenous villages. PODD, or Participatory One Health Disease Detection, is an integrated community health surveillance system. It is a collaboration project among Open Dream, Chiang Mai University, and the Chiang Mai Provincial Government. Under the PODD system, local volunteers selected will report any suspicious health incidents in their communities through the PODD application on their mobile phone. Data will then be sent to the PODD system for assessing the risks of outbreaks. Once the case is verified, PODD will send digital alerts to the reporting communities and responsible agencies to devise and implement control measures. The system will also provide preliminary guidance to the communities on disease control. In the first 16 months, PODD has received thousands of reports and 36 of them had been verified as outbreaks. According to a study by Chiang Mai University, an outbreak of foot and mouth disease could cause economic damage up to 4 million US dollars. Imagine if we couldn't stop those outbreaks, the damage would potentially cost millions of dollars. PODD is currently expanding to other locations, both inside Thailand and abroad, to achieve the highest goals in preventing pandemic and protecting humanity.